And since moving their games to lockdown, businesses in the area are feeling the love. ABC 3340's Valerie Bell joins us there now. And Valerie, this is the second season since the UAB Blazers decided to move from Legion Field to a protective stadium. Is it making a difference? Brenda, according to fans and businesses, it really is. People who have been out here tailgating tell me this is a much better location to do it and food places in the area say they've been seeing an increase in sales on game days. Go Blazers! Go Blazers! <laughs> it's game day. We're super excited about the crowds. K and J Elegant Pastries got a taste of those crowds in Uptown from the World Games. I'm from Birmingham, so I've always loved to see the revitalization of downtown. So, you know, bringing the stadium, that's going to bring a ton of crowds. Owner Crystal Bryant says on a normal day, they sell five to 700 cupcakes. Today, they're expecting to sell more. UAB and Alabama a and logos on them. Adding sales have been up 400% since moving from Alabaster to this location in April. No regrets at all. And at Eugene's Hot Chicken. On the game day, I mean, we'll have a line down the street. Since UAB started playing at Protective, it's been... Hey, more people, more money. Almost hard to keep up. I've been trying to adjust my schedule to keep up with theirs. I mean, we have been really busy in mornings and at night. Um, we feed most of the players, coaches, and I mean, facilitate uh, our customers as well. Blazer fans agree that opening protective stadium last October has been better to tailgate and better to enjoy the game. Light years beyond it because everything's closer. You're closer to getting into the stadium and inside the stadium, you're much closer to the action. With all due respect to Legion Field, this is a shiny new facility in a very vibrant part of town that uh, has a lot going for it. And it's, uh, it's a lot of fun for um, the diehards like me and the casual fan, I think. And the game starts in about two hours. And those fans I spoke with say it's just so convenient to have the restaurants and bars so close to the stadium. And you can see there are already a lot of people out here tailgating and supporting those local businesses. Live in Birmingham, Valerie Bell, ABC 3340 News.